Vote now. Vote past. And good morning. Welcome to Level Up. This is ZSX straight out of bed. Oh, God. What are you talking about? You slept like nine fucking hours. Yeah, it doesn't mean I didn't just get up. Anyway, I'm cold. I'm here, and we're going to go live ready. with the hand cooler. And what a map choice. I mean, hectic versus cooler. I, I don't have been seen playing that map in this tournament before, so it's going to be very interesting. Yeah, I really, really um, think the hand's going to take this cooler. I hate this map. But you never know, Kula is a machine. He's Russian, so that, that counts for a lot to be <laughs> just a Russian Russian. Yeah, yeah. anyway. Yeah, I'm not looking too bad. He took uh, most of the major items on the map, and now the hang is sort of trapped. Yeah, I don't think the hang is a rail, which is really Find bad. Find a way on this out map. of that, and there's a good yeah, shot. He got it, but he took a rail, so he can't press for the red. He's going to try and take the mega, but Kula's uh, yeah, going to cut him off. Oh, wow, that was a good what a push! push. The hang nice. um, hits a good defensive rocket, but there's <laughs> a very bad spawn, spawn for him. Oh, cooler. Oh, that's already 2 to nil. And the hack is known for being a very fast paced map. And Kula is just taking the Mega Health very comfortable because the hang just spawned near the rocket launcher and now it's up to the hang. Yeah, but as we saw the hang yesterday, he's, his timing is always spot on and he presses items very well. He just took the red. Nice play. Yeah. You just put it nicely yesterday because he said um, he bases his game around his timing, so he will always be there at the Mega Health. But Kula is on fire, unlike yesterday, for whatever reason he has turned it on today against the Hang. I guess like he wanted to, which is fine. He's hungry. We like to watch Kula when he's playing. Ah, uh, but that's bad. Look at that. Kula was a bit too early for the red armor. And then again, Kula, um, the Hang's right on time for the red and the Mega. He's yeah, yeah his timing's on. <laughs> But his shots aren't. <laughs> yeah, Kula just hit two raids in a row. But oh, wow, look at Kula's fun. rail. Look, 62. We just had like 70% on ZTN. So Kula <laughs> with an amazing rail today. Yeah. It's not going to look good for Kula. Kula is right all now. aim, no brain at the minute. But. <laughs> the hang again, stealing away that red. His positions when these items are up are and very Kula good. And Kula is not happy yeah. with that. This because be now he's trapped and the hang has an easy job. Just you know, He can just play the patient game here. And he's yet again just in time to pick up the mega health. So that kill was just in time. Yeah, but we can see the hang's timing is allowing him to get in very good position and deal out so much damage to Kula. But this time Kula's got good position. Oh, uh, there's a lot of rocket damage for Dahang. Lucky, lucky Dahang. Gets away with 21 HP. Yeah, and very lucky. Dahang. Ah, uh, not Dahang, huh? Kula just died there. But, uh, there's nothing big up ground for a while. Kula might be able to get on the Mega. Yeah, he does. Oh, wow. the teleporter. Why is that? How da on earth did Dahang steal that? I really don't know how that happened. Wow. <laughs> nice. Okay, yep. double kill. That <laughs> means a fresh start sword. for both. But I think Kula is going to get the better one here. Yeah, He's having the rocket launch and can just defend easily versus the hang who just took the teleporter. Yeah, too aggressive with just a rail. Kula had the rockets. He's always going to win that. And now Kula is trying to find an angle on the hang. The hang is high. Probably wants that rail. But as long as he uh, remains high position, he can take position. And look at that! That is just superb timing. Yeah. He totally knew the timing and knew when to take the teleporter entrance. Yeah, it's amazing. So Hang's playing well. He's got a good grip on uh, how to attack on this map. But Kula is getting a bit early for the items and positioning himself not so well. But his rail and his just overall aim today has been unbelievable. And there's obviously Hadlima right now. And there was a good rocket and oh, now wow. dang has to be wow. so careful. Yeah. Um, Surely, Kula can get on this red. Yeah, Kula Dahang gets the, uh, fire, man. the rail spawn again. Pretty unlucky for Dahang. Now every item on the map is up, and Kula is just waiting for a good opportunity to take that red armor. Mega health has been taken, and Dahang is like the most mega-oriented player I've seen this tournament on Hectic. It was it's pretty awesome. Well, yeah, with his with his timing, Kula's not really sure how to even defend the uh, Mega. Uh, it's probably about a bit of a lack of experience there that he's not dealing enough damage to the hand when he gets the Mega. Exactly. So, just uh, was just about to say that because uh, Rafa did really well. He um, always trapped the hang when he was going to the Mega, and there's the next frag. Yeah, the hang's 
the Hang's attacks on the red and the mega have been amazing. Really showing his experience on this map. Yeah. If you want to watch Kilsen Avak, they're just about to start on ZTN. Yeah, they've just started TV2. And now we're tight again, and Dehang has a really good stack, and he's in a good position to take that red armor. Yeah, Cool is going to be re uh, really hard pushed to do anything right now. The, the yellow's not up, <laughs> he's not even going to get a green. Nah, Dehang is just going to do like that, and he's going in aggressive, but. The only thing Cool has really got to do is try not to give up a couple of frags, because that could be bad. Yeah, Dehang's stack is going to get bigger with this mega. Cool has got a rail. Oh no. Sorry, he's been high. That's my bad. <laughs> Yeah, but to hang is yet again in a really good position, but Kula this time has got the Mega, but this is more or less a trap here. Great dodging to get out of there and wow. hit a rail, that was amazing. Yeah. One of the reasons why the hang doesn't really like to play Kula is because of his dodging, and Kula just proved why that is. No, but ever since the hands got control, he's playing very, very solid. Nevertheless, great rocket. LG. And the hang is Ooh. running out of LG, so he has to back off. And there's Cooler going in aggressive, and he knows the <laughs> hang is very low. But the hang has got positioning. Look at that. Just Spot on. Dealing away. Uh, <laughs> lucky Cooler knocks oh. himself into the teleport. <laughs> yeah, he's not happy. Oh, that was a good rail though. But again, the hand steals another item. Even though Kula's on two health, but he really can't do anything. The 50's not up. The 25's not up. He's just stuck. Yeah, you Kula got to run. He got out of there. He'll get. He should get this uh, yellow if he sticks around. No, this is bad. He's going to be trapped with nothing. Oh. If he hit that rocket, he could have got in on the red, but. Never mind. Great rocket. Still, yeah, the hang looks far more solid on this map in control than Kula does. He's dealing out a lot more damage and stealing items that he really shouldn't have. Yeah, and Kula can't take these fights. He knows that the hang is um, really, really stacked at the moment. Oh, reasonably stacked, but the problem is how many frags does Kula have to give up? to get back into the game. We yeah. still have three minutes left, but... Well, this is not a winning score yet, but it just... Uh, Kuda's not getting anything. He didn't get the yellow, he didn't get the mega, he didn't get the red, so... He needs a rail. And that's the only way I can see him coming back. He's hitting some good shots with his 70% uh, rail average today. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, like, that's there we go. an average I can live with. Yeah. And speaking of which, Kula just rail to hang just like that. Perfect rocket to rail. And, uh, oh, still has enough time to get back to this. Yeah, he really should have protected that from high, because if the Hang shoots in here, Kuda's going to die. But no, the, the Hang's probably going to play it safe. He's got a five frag lead, two minutes remaining. He doesn't need to push. With his experience, he could probably hide a bit better and pick out the angles. <laughs> oh, <laughs> half a second early there. That's the, I think that's the first timing mistake from the Hang that we've seen. Uh, yes, by the way, it is, it's best of five all day. Oh, two good rockets by the hang, but Kula gets away. And this is really bad news for the hang because that means that Kula can get the mega health bot. This was a good steal here by the hang, positioned himself well uh, just to get a better angle on that red armor in case. Uh, nice, cool nice rail. Really That's uh, fifty-seven percent. He doesn't even know the angles, and he's hitting uh, nearly sixty percent. <laughs> so that's uh, a joke rail. But Avec is winning two 0 against Kilson. Four minutes gone. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, wow. Avec's playing much better today as well. So good on him. Cool adjusted time. I thought I, I thought uh, the hang was going to push. It. Wow, <laughs> that incredible rail. But a uh, bad uh, weapon choice yeah. cost him there. That's the kind of shit he needs to pull if he wanted to bring back this score. Four frags now and the hang's got a, a reasonable stack to work with. Yeah, he just has to remain high positioning here and just wait for Kula to do the next move. He has the red armor and he has got good positioning. He yeah, just hit rails, one rail, that's that very important. really hurt Kula because now he can't push in. Look, yeah. Yeah, this, that's the game over for me.
Do we know what the next map is? I have absolutely no clue. I mean, Cooler keeping this to a 17-2 score, Dahan's best map, arguably, is amazing since Cooler hates this map. He refuses to practice it. He only played it a couple of times before this tournament. Yeah. Um, and this map is all angles, and we saw that Cooler was, wasn't comfortable. It's kind of the same story with Battle Force, you know? Yeah, yeah, definitely. But I mean, 17 2 is a good match. He could have got smashed, and it was just the hang experience that won him. There's nothing else. But I'm pretty sure Cooler knows that. Yeah, I, I'm, yeah, I don't. He doesn't look angry. Uh, I guess he expected to lose his map. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, four nil, Avec, Kilson in control by the looks of it. Five minutes, four minutes remaining, nearly. Um, I missed the maps because I was asleep. So. And I just got here as well, so we are with yeah, we did thirteen. Well. Yeah, third map. Best of five, quarter final. Spectator, here. hang is already ready. Yeah, um, I'm gonna say Cooler. Without, even though there's no rail, obviously Cooler's a rail hole. We did, we did, a, we did <laughs> see a very interesting A play against Sturmy yesterday, but I think that was yeah. very emotional play by Cooler. Oh. But then again, he said he played, you know, he played honestly or the way he's, you know, he just gave it all. That's what he said. But it was just very rocket jump heavy, and I don't know. Will be interesting to see what Kula pulls oh, up that, this that, time. That was a very different deal to the scene. Uh, it was crazy. <laughs> Yesterday was just uh, yeah. Me and Rapper really enjoyed watching that. We had no clue what was going on. Quite drama, but uh, yeah. Anyway, we're we're going live. No, I the hang with the better sport getting the rocket key. Should be able to push it on the mega. Oh, Kula is not stupid. Yeah, he's backed up on his side. Wow, the hang risk. What an aggressive move. Oh, what dodging oh, move. it's not really paying out. And Kula was just oh. amazing dodge. That bloody Russian, he just was moved amazing. so fast. <laughs> yeah, the, the Russians coming out. Um, that was a that was a lucky spawn for the hang. Lucky lucky spawn. And look at that, Kula is going in so aggressive, just pushing the hang away. And but De Hang doesn't have a rocket launcher, so he has to be careful. And he's also going to be uh, yeah. Kula has late position. for the red armor. Kula, Kula is just going to take it. Yeah, that's a free 200 stack right there from De Hang, but he had nothing. He had nothing to work with, so he's going to really have to play it safe if uh, he's going to keep a keep a score. Oh, that was one. a good trap. But Kula is uh, just going to try to deny that armor, but. He should be careful not to take too much damage, but, but then again, De Hang was the one that's out of position here. Taking so much damage. <laughs> cool, let's just going in with minigun, uh, yeah. with machine gun. Jesus, man. Cool is like a suicide bomber there. He just <laughs> ran at De Hang. And Kula is angry. Yeah, Kula is really on form today. Those are the okay. days. I don't think the hands use anything but the plasma. Yeah. <laughs> so it's, it's not. There we go. Uh, he's got he's got the full. Oh, now he's got he's got lightning on. So and he's also in good position for the red armor if he's quick enough. And yeah, yes, he, he just took it. And now Kula's just going to try to set the trap. Very nice. Well, that was too late. But the Megal's up, and Kula's way too far away. So De Hang is in good position. Let's switch over to De Hang and let's look what he's doing yep. with the, the stack. He just what built himself up. He only lost a one frag from uh, in Cooler's reign and he's built himself a big, big stack. De Hang's lightning gun is a bit off. Yeah, Cooler, Cooler ripped him apart there. He really did. That was nice. And he stole the red, taking nothing, virtually no damage. Uh, yeah, uh, Avex just about to win ZTN 6-0. Interesting turn of events. Hang did a great job working himself into that mega room, stealing it, and then also in a good position for the red armor. So that means Kula has to work with the yellows. Yeah, that's not too bad. If we switch over, he's got himself a hundred stack, and uh, but the hangs coming from behind. That's not good. And just stole away a yellow. 
Wow, great rockets. Yeah. The hang's gonna be stuck here now. If he pushes out, he's gonna take more damage. Yeah. Yeah, cool. and Kula also has Kula's that 50 HP bubble wow. that he can take in mid fight, but he doesn't even have to. No, just look just at that weapon the choice. There. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Just yeah. the rockets, so he can't get in, and then he ate the rockets, and then plasma gun on long range, just to annoy But if know, he used the him. machine gun, um, the hang would have got away, but the, the plasma just instantly killed him. Amazing, by Kula. Yeah. And he the shotgun the hang here. He knew he wouldn't go up top without a rocket. But, uh, that shotgun does so much damage when it shouldn't do. Wow. There's a big difference between camping and setting traps. <laughs> nice <laughs> prediction from Kula. Yeah, the smiley comes out. I don't know if you will have to think the hands thinking <laughs> because uh, I didn't even know it as well. Yeah, oh, this is and running, the next one. This is running away from the hands. a very high hand. score for, for DM13 here. And now Kula is happy because uh, he's playing on his turf. Yeah, I think um, this is going to run away from the hand. Kula's had a big stack for a while. I mean, Kula just has way more experience on this map. He has been playing this map for ages. Nice to hang. Yeah. More or less, uh... You come oh, well, that was some good shaft damage. Kula taking that rock jump was a high risk, but he didn't know that the hang was already on the top level. So... Yeah, I mean, they're pretty on the even stacks now. I mean, Hula <laughs> lost timing on the Mega, but that's all right, as long as the hang doesn't push in, which, yeah, he's going to do. Oh, but that was some good defensive rocket, yeah. and that's... Yeah, the hang, the hang baited going for the yellow and dropped Drake down, but Kula didn't fall for that. Great prediction rocket. Yeah. Kula, once again, doing these aggressive rocket jumps, and there, once again, these defensive prediction rockets are just amazing. Yeah. Kula just out. knows that... The Hang just wants it so desperately right now. Yeah, but the Hang doesn't really have to worry. He's, he got a frag, and there's uh, four and a half minutes remaining. Plenty of time. Yeah, but then again, the Hang tries to intercept Kula, but Kula is just reading him too well. Yeah, he's trying to force a frag when he doesn't need to, and he's given up a lot of health and armor, and even a frag. It's going to be too hard. Oh, missed rocket jump, I guess. And <laughs> Kula <laughs> Wrecking so bad. Yeah, he's focused today. He's uh, chatting a lot of Russian. I'm a bit scared to be honest. Yeah, nice rocket. That ate up most of the red armor there. Yeah, but Kula's not gonna get onto that mega health, or at least he doesn't want to because, uh, you yeah, know, right. with that stack, can't really challenge it. They have to hang and sensor map. But Kula is fine with these yellows. He can uh, just continue to play like that. And what is he doing now? Um, no, he's I just took a brief pause there. Nice rocket, that's going to set the hang back. <laughs> but Kula just needs to run the yellows now, he doesn't really need to push for an item. As long as he does damage, perfect time on the red, he should still do it. Oh, wow. beautiful air rocket. <laughs> wow. <laughs> and Rafa just laughed at that. Yeah, <laughs> he Rafa, was like, Rafa's happy. WTF, what is he doing? What is he pulling off today? I think Kula had a good sleep. Yeah, Kula's definitely refreshed from last night where he wasn't playing his best. Yeah. Yeah, and Kula just took that 50 HP in mid fight, so he just, you know, took another sneak and just had an easy task yeah. uh, killing De Hang in that situation. Crazy shotgun. <laughs> what is Dang. going on with that shotgun? Yeah, another, this is another crazy DM13 match, really. De Hang pulling out some weird moves, but it's working on. Yeah, probably some unorthodox moves that Kula's not really used to. They also haven't been played too much against each other, but 
It's not as bad as Cooler as um, Wu, for instance. So, but uh, two minutes remaining. Uh, Four frags the difference. I really, really can't see the handful of his back at all. Cool is not going to even challenge for items. He just needs to run the yellows and keep out of sight. Yeah, but this is over. Look at that. So much damage just trying to get to Cooler. These these corridors are a pain. But one health. <laughs> oh, the what? shotgun did so much damage. One HP. And I just did my pants as Cooler said. Whatever he said. Cooler Even a few of these plasma bullets just is ripping through the hand stack. He's not got a big stack. Well, two, two frags two left, frags. a minute left, yeah. Now Cooler. Cooler has to be careful. Two frags in one minute is definitely possible, given the fact that Cooler just had the shotgun spawn and is surely gonna go down oh, here. Wow. And where is he gonna spawn? He just took the red armor spawn, so that's very fortunate for him. So he's gonna get out of there. But he, I don't think he's going to take that jump pad just yet. He just wants to make sure that um, Jahang is not here. He's, yeah. he's got himself 120 armor and this should be Well, this be is enough. a very nice room to stay in because you've got a lot of options. And there's Jahang going in aggressive and he knows what's at stake here. He has to get that frag with Kula. Just plus backing and just in time for that at armor. Yeah, Kula was just trying to wait around long enough to to, to make sure his plasma really hit the hang in those little corridors. Wow, he couldn't. Oh, oh he couldn't get through that door uh, teleporter. His rockets kept knocking. I think him back. he was like waiting for the hang to go first, <laughs> like just baiting him. But he was like he was like sort of uh, fake strafing towards it, just making sure that he doesn't get hit. Oh, no. oh yeah, the hand. That's gonna oh, really wow. annoy Kula. Kula can be lucky that he uh, survived that push. Yeah, he's he's, he's not happy with that. But overtime, overtime's always a lifeline. You have taken the lead. Oh, that's not looking good. The hang, having the mega health, and is in a good position for the red armor. That means Kula just having that yellow and is already pushing. Very. Avec has um, forfeited hectic. <laughs> um, it's 16 nil. Anyway, um, back to this month. 8 7 in favour of the hang, who is now in complete control. He's just going to try and control this mid, make sure Kula can't get on any big items. I'd switch to Kula, but Skula. Uh, Skula. <laughs> Kula took a lot of items. But the hang's got the two big ones, which is what Kula needs. Oh, oh no. That was a good one. Oh. And there's the next yep. drag. And that's, that's a good game. Cooler's not going to have anything. He can have a lightning gun, but that's about it. Yeah, Cooler just had to take a risk going in there um, when Dahang was about to take that mega hull. Yeah, Dahang. Was like his last chance, but. Yeah, Dahang had played perfectly since, since getting control, but. Cooler gave a couple of frags up way too easy because he wanted to take away items when the hang was right there and it's really cost him. And that's surely a twist we didn't expect. What do you think? Oh yeah, definitely. I, I couldn't see the hang doing it, but he pulled it out, which is all credit to the hang. He played really well. Yeah, and also, I mean, the hang won versus Rafael. No, the hang's no slouch. I mean, everyone knows the hang is a good player. But everyone expects Cooler to do to uh, win the M13. Yeah. Whoa. Two one the hang, leaving Cooler needing to win the next two <laughs> maps to stay in the tournament. And where's my something coffee? he didn't expect when he knew he had to face the hang. Uh, no, we can't put Cooler on webcam because he might eat it. And uh, we need it for the screen. Oh, Furious Heights. Um, the good thing or the bad thing about Furious Heights is that the hang really likes this map. So he's really good on it and it's going to be very challenging once again for Cooler. So we'll see what uh, we do now. But then again, um, Cooler has got a good rail today. Seems to be on form and Raygun on T7 is very important. 
Yeah, T7, and then going to be Error Walk if Kula does manage to bring this up. But uh, the hang is very good on this map as well. But as Rafa was saying yesterday, Kula's rail is amazing on this map. And if he carries on railing like he has been, the hang's going to find it very hard. Yeah, I think Rafa said he has to deny the rail angles against Kula. Yeah, something, cool, cool al something along the lines. Prepare to fight. Moon line. Okay, let's start with her hang. Getting the Mega Health spawn and going straight in, trying to peek a shot onto Kula. Jahang setting up for that red armor and just trying to figure out where Kula is going to attack from. And Kula ha obviously has got the rear gun. So Jahang has to be careful. Oh, he's in a very good position there. It's Kula just trying to do some damage on him. But Jahang is going to have a really hard job if he uh, wanted to push that um, mega health without a rail. So he just went back to took one, uh, take one. Okay, let's switch over to Kula quickly to see what he's got. He's got a big stack. And he's got the rail, which is, uh, yeah, very good. The hang's, the hang's going to have to go just try and do some damage, really, because he's severely on the back foot. Red and Mega at the same time, so if he can position himself in the middle of the map, he might use sound cues to see what Kula's trying to do. Yeah, but Kula's been very sneaky here. And now the hang yeah. is just going to wait for Kula. Yeah, he's got that position which he needed. Yeah. He could just take the red and get out of there. Or he could have also just taken the Mega Health in case Kula went for the red, but... Yeah, yeah. But that, that's what I mean, like, you know, he's standing in center map, so he has the option. No, definitely. But he knew Kula was going to go for the Mega, having uh, both yellows to work with after, so... But this is fine for Dahang. He's got all the weapons he needs to defend himself, and a facial rocket is really going to help him. That's perfect timing, jumping oh. straight onto the Mega when, uh, Red when it spawns. Wow, and we got the hang timing really, really coming out there. But the crazy Pac-Man steals away the red, uh, the mega, and the yellow, <laughs> and forces the hang out the room. <laughs> wow, cooler man, just pulling off kind of stunts no one else should or would. Yeah, and because of that push by Kula, uh, the Hang really, really can't attack the next item. He's just going to have to sit in the middle again. Yeah. Oh, Kula pushing in. Yeah. Kula's not going to get on it. So, but that was, that was a good play by the Hang. I think Kula's trying to sit. No. Not letting Kula in in that situation. I mean, they're fairly stacked right now. Uh, fairly equally stacked. Yeah, and they've got equal, e pretty equal Despite stacks. Despite the fact that he just took the Mega Health. And um, they've both got all the weapons they need, so it's, it's not going to be a big fight at all. It's already in the Mega. The hands in the air. Nice rockets by Kula. The hang really, really can't do anything now. Nice rails though. They're going to accept hitting the two really good yeah. rails. Kula's rail. I don't think I don't think Kula's hit a rail yet. Yeah, he must have hit one or two, but not the rail we saw earlier on on ZTN or Hectic. Nevertheless, he's got he's built himself a stack despite taking two rails. And uh, Red and Mega again are at the same time. So until someone is able to take both and start separating them, it's going to be a pretty passive match, I reckon. Yeah. So once again, Kula getting the Mega Health and Dahang the Red. But so that, but it's still fine. just equal. Yeah, but that's fine for Kula because now Dahang is 100-200 and Kula is 200-200.
the hang yeah and uh, eating a rail he's in a very bad position clever play by cooler the hang but the hang expecting something so just getting out of there A lot of spam coming up from the hand, knowing Cooler's going to be trying to chase him. He's got himself in a really, really bad position here. Oh, now the hang is low. Nice. Yeah, it's nice. And, he, and now the hang gets the miracle shotgun spawn, oh, which yeah. he doesn't. He gets the, the grenade spawn. He still gets away with life yeah. though, and didn't take too much damage. No, so cool, that's very important. Cooler for him. really didn't want to risk one of those random grenades smacking him in the face, so he just got out of there. Oh, there's a good rail. So Cooler has to retreat only seven. Well, he just took the 50 HP bubble, but still, he's in a very bad position for the red armor. Yeah, that rail's going to nullify virtually all of the mega that Cooler's going to get. Leaving Cooler with, uh, with nothing. Yeah, Cooler has to be really, really, really careful right now. Avec Kilson is 3 1 Avec, 1 1 in maps, uh, 2 minutes remaining on DM13. The hang's sitting nice now, he's going he's to push for this mega. Cooler's not going to hang around. Yeah, Cooler can't afford to give up a frag at this stage because the hang stack is so big. Cooler's completely missed the mega. That's that's a big mistake. I'm pretty sure he's gonna just figure it out. Yeah, yeah. He's, he's left the hang the whole map right now. But yeah, that's good defensive play, dodging, nice rockets, LG spam, keeping the hang away. But, but again, the hang really does want to push as well because he can take a lot of damage or even get or even die because uh, of cool as it's defensive rockets. And uh, this being a big map for the hang and a big map for Cooler because uh, if Cooler loses, he's out. So he's, I don't think we're going to see anything ridiculous coming out right now. Yeah. Kula is just going to wait for Jahang to make a mistake here, I think. Yeah, I mean, Kula's on the back foot. Red and Mega up again, so if he can keep keep the hang out, he can take the Mega and pretty much take control of the map, which he has done very nicely. So just from sitting around, he's taken control of the map. Yeah, now Kula is in a good position to pressure the hang a bit here, but he ha still has to catch him off guard. Yeah, we won't, I don't think we'll be seeing any crazy pushes, just trying to set up traps. It's a much, much safer option when, uh, when you're not wanting to yeah. give up anything. Nice, cool, 200, 200. He's really going to try and push, but... But the hang is... Yeah, the hang's going to get out of there. <laughs> you really don't want to give up a frag either. This is quite similar to the, the uh, final we saw with Rafa and Cypher. No one really want to do anything. They're quite happy just, uh, ouch, cool, out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> cool was chatting to us. Oh, that were two good rockets, but Kula is going to get out of there and just, that so that's, that's last I mean. rocket yeah. was really detrimental to the hang. If the hang tries to push, it's always risking eating at least one of those. And another one, he would have been dead. Uh, that's why the hang is so hesitant in pushing against Cooler. Wow, nice rail. Unusual position for Cooler to be in. Doesn't matter. Doesn't set back the hang though. Fills up a 150-150 stack, uh, leaving Cooler with pretty much nothing. Ooh, that's gonna be very wow. bad. And the hang is rushing in, and if that's not the frag. Cooler what? can be very, very happy. He's that push is amazing. I, I don't understand why the hang backed off. Wow. I think... Jeez, Cooler's got to do something mental now. <laughs> Otherwise he's going to lose to the player that no one expected him to lose to. 
Oh dear, this is going to be an upset. So Hangs 200, 240 seconds remaining. Oh, there's one. 11 health by Cooler. That he, was a direct rocket that he He's going to have to set up a trap because he hasn't got enough time to build a stack. And this is it. He has to push. Oh, there's the rocket. What? But no. He switched to rail. Oh, That's but it. you would have had to hit Cooler's, two more rockets. Cooler quit the server. But you would have had to it's hit two more rockets in that switch situation. Over to I think that was a really good tra yeah. uh, trap that Cooler tried to pull Switch over off, to the webcam quickly. And Let's uh, get our looking cooler. He's just, yeah, he shook down Hang's hand, but he's not happy. <laughs> I think you guys at IRC expected to see a punch up or something. <laughs> it's not going to happen. They're not going to beat each other up. Wow, the Hang, he should be happy with himself because the way Cooler was playing on ZTN, I think everyone thought it was going to be a 3 0 walkover. Yeah. That, but Jesus, the Hang, yeah. Jesus was at the hang side. <laughs> I think if you if you look at it back, Hectic was probably one of the problems that Kula had due to the practice because he t I don't know, but Furious Heights and Hectic, you know, the, the more or less new maps, they just suit the hang so well. Yeah, well, you could say that, but Kula played exceptionally well on Hectic, not even knowing the map. You could argue if he practiced it, he could be the best or one of the best on the map. But it's his own fault for not doing so. The same happened at QuakeCon, giving up a free map to everyone in the best of five. Battleforge. Yeah. Uh, I think we're going to get to Hangover to see his uh, how happy but Mr. Buzz Lightyear is. <laughs> yeah, so uh, that's it. Cooler out in the quarterfinals. Yeah, and he's nodding, so he's up for an interview. Yeah. We're going to get the hangover. Do you want to do it? I don't mind. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, okay. I'm just going to get a bit of sip of water in. And here is the hang. Okay, guys, welcome back. I've got to hang with me, and who just won in a very exciting match against Kula. So, how do you feel after that very impressive win? Uh, I feel really good. Um, I feel good because there's something about his ZTN game that, I mean, he's definitely a really good ZTN player, but I just I feel like I should be able to beat him at least once. I've, I've never beaten him in ZTN. So, when I went down 0-1, I was really frustrated, but uh, I knew I should win Hectic, which it was harder than it should have been in my mind, but uh, he played pretty well, I thought. And then DM13, I, I took some risks because I figured there's no way I'm going to win unless I take some risks. I mean, I made mistakes early on, but uh, then the risks paid off because I did tons of damage and uh, pushed it overtime for a win. And then, I don't know, Furious Heights, so intense. And yeah, Furious Heights was really intense. I mean, it was just a back and forth because neither of you wanted to take a risk. Right, right, right. But in the end, uh, you just pulled it off there. Um, yeah, well, amazing match. I think you're happy with yourself. Do you know who you've got to play next out of the next two players? Or well, I mean, who? who I assume I don't play Rafa because I played him in the groups. Like, yeah. I can't potentially play him, but I haven't seen the brackets. So I so. don't think anyone's really seen the brackets. Yeah. Um, let's go into the controversy that was yesterday. <laughs> How did you feel being the centre of attention about the player everyone wanted to play? Apparently, um, I mean. So it doesn't. It really doesn't bother me. I mean, <laughs> it must. I mean, you just showed to the world that even if it if it was what it was, <laughs> you beat Cooler. You yeah. smashed him. Well, bad mistake by Cooler, huh? Yeah. yeah. Uh, I don't know. I thought I thought the rules should have been that a first seed plays a second seed uh, randomly, like draw from a hat or whatever, because it's just you. Because the groups, if they're not all played at the same time, you give players. Uh, knowledge of who they could potentially be playing so but yeah I mean I, I really don't care about the being center of attention and all that stuff <laughs> <laughs> nah, <laughs> never mind then uh, I presume you want to go off and get some food and uh, check out your next opponents so we won't yeah. really keep you but uh, I think everyone on IRC was cheering for you well, well played man thanks a lot uh, see you later okay. thanks <laughs> 